Hey guys, um, today we'll be looking at level 1 maths, algebra paper, 2012, day 1, question 2C2. Okay, so this is actually a follow-on question from 2C1, uh, so I've kind of done both of them together in this part, um, you can kind of follow it in the, as we go. So the question was, solve x over 5 minus 2x minus 1 over 2, greater than or equal to negative 3x over 5. Okay, so... The first thing I need to do is, um, the right-hand side, I need to write it as a single fraction. So, to, and I know between 5 and 2, uh, the least common multiple is 10. So I'm going to multiply that by 2, well, x over 5 by 2 and 2, and 2x minus 1 over 2, um, basically 5 and 5, so that I get the denominators, uh, both of the denominators, as 10. So this part here, I'm going to have 2x over 10 minus 5, times 2x minus 1 divided by 10 as well and that's greater than or equal to negative 3x over 5 so I know I keep um, mentioning this to some of you guys but um, please be careful with that um, minus 5 because um, that minus 5 will affect the entire bracket so it'll affect the entire 2x minus 1 so what I mean by is you're gonna have 2x minus 5 times 2 is 10x and then negative 5 multiplied by negative 1 would actually be positive 5. Now that's all divided by 10. So that's greater than or equal to minus 3x over 5. So simplifying the left-hand side, 2x minus 10x is going to give me minus 8x plus 5 over 10. Now I believe this is where 2c1, the question stops, and then it follows on to 2c2 where you have to actually do this inequality. Okay, so we have greater than or equal to negative 3x over 5. So, just moving the space up here, guys. Alright, now we need to do is rearrange so that we have x by itself. So I'm going to cross multiply, so the 5 is going to come to the numerator on the um, right uh, left-hand side. So I'm going to get 5 multiplied by negative 8x plus 5 is greater than or equal to, and the 10 is going to be cross multiplied to the other side, the right hand side, so it'll be 9, minus 3x multiplied by 10. So at this point, um, expanding the left hand side, I'm going to get negative 40x plus 25 is greater than or equal to minus 30x, because minus 3x times 10 is minus 30x. So rearranging everything, I'm just going to move the 25 over first, so it'll become minus 25. And since I can't do anything with it, I am going to uh, bring over the negative 30x, which changes to positive 30x. And that's greater than or equal to minus 25. Simplifying the um, left-hand side, I'm going to get negative 10x is greater than or equal to negative 25. Now, this is something that you must remember, that when you divide um, by a negative num number, the inequality sign changes. So in this case, x will be less than or equal to negative 25 divided by negative 10. Uh, and as you can see, I'm dividing by a negative number. Because I'm dividing by a negative number, the inequality sign changes. So simplifying this, I'm going to get x is less than or equal to positive 2.5. Okay, and that's your answer for this question. Thanks for watching, guys.